Hi, I'm Smita and in this video, let's understand more about how you can send and receive messages via Interact. Let's first see what are the different types of messages that can be sent from your inbox. And then we will look at the other nifty features like chat events that enable easy team collaboration for your WhatsApp conversations. This right here inside the inbox is your composer section where you and your team can send WhatsApp messages to your users. Interact enables you to send both text messages and messages with media like pictures, videos and emojis. To send the message, you can click on the send button here or you can simply use the keyboard shortcut that is Ctrl plus enter to send messages faster. Notice the double blue ticks here. This shows that the user has read the message. This appearance of the red receipts will depend on whether the user has turned this feature on or off at their end. Here we have a set of built-in rich media options that you can use in your conversations. First up, we have quick replies. You can now make frequently asked questions as quick replies and send them out to users in one single click. What's more, you get to personalize these quick replies by adding media and variables such as name, phone number, email ID and more. Let's send out a quick reply to this user. And that's how it appears to your user. Check out our video on quick replies to know all about it. Conversations on WhatsApp are always better with media files and emojis. Interact lets you send documents, images and videos. The media file size will be the same as what WhatsApp supports. You can just click here to attach a media file and if you would like to insert a note to this image, you can just type that out here and then hit send. Now, Interact's inbox also supports sending WhatsApp approved templates to users. These templates give you and your team the ability to send interactive messages with buttons to users. Let's see how this works. We are now going to send a pre-approved WhatsApp template to this user. This is your user's WhatsApp chat screen and this is how the template will appear to the user. You can watch our video on WhatsApp templates to learn more about it. Now, besides having multiple options to send messages to your users, Intrax Inbox also enables you to easily coordinate with your teammates. This is made possible with the help of notes and chat events. The notes feature lets you create notes about users that you can refer back to later. You can easily insert notes in your conversation by switching to the notes mode in the inbox. Notes are like messages but they don't get sent to the user. You can add notes in your conversation and help your teammates understand the context better when you reassign the chat to them. Now that we have explored the chat area, let's understand what are chat events and agent initials. Chat events are status updates that pop up in your chat screen with the user. These will be visible only to you and your teammates. For example, these could be updates like when you assign a conversation to a teammate. You then get to see when the chat was assigned to your teammate. Coming to Agent Initials, Intrax Shared Team Inbox displays icons with agent initials that will help you instantly know who has been responding to the user in these conversations. Along with these agent initials, you also get to see the user's initials. That's all we've got for now. Watch our next video to know all about how you can create and send quick replies to your users.